Hey planner friends, it's Mandy from My Unique Plans. And today I'm going to decorate for the week of March the 16th in my classic dashboard layout. And I'm challenging myself to try to use up some of my old sticker books this month. There are so many new beautiful sticker books that I really really think I want and need but I already have way too many sticker books so this week I have chosen a couple oldies but goodies the today is the day book and the productivity mini book and we're gonna see if we can do a whole spread with nothing but those two books so we're gonna go ahead and get those out of there and let's see now I know this is St. Patrick's week but I really don't have much St. Patrick's -y going on Oops. so the first thing I want to do I'm gonna grab some white out because I want to change these sections a little bit and I'm actually going to go ahead and I'm just going to white out over all these because I'm going to be putting some stickers down. All right, get a little bubble there. So I've got my white out down. And now, what I want to do, I want to start with this side of the page. Um, I like this one that says, get it, girl. Storms don't last forever. You know, that's a really good one to use right now. Trust your gut. So I think we're going to start with this. Storms don't last forever sticker. And we're going to kind of put it in the middle here. What else do we have in here in that green color? Trust your gut. Let's get rid of this where it says focus. So we're gonna put trust your gut right there. And since I don't have a real busy week, I can do a little more decorative than what I normally do. And then I think to go with this bright green, I'm going to bring in a little bit of black. And this sticker that says, Be Fierce, is going to kind of help me bring in that black element a little bit. Let's see. We may come back to this page in a minute. All right, so normally I would use this for my running to-do list, but this week I'm gonna do something a little bit different. And I'm gonna take this grateful sticker and then I'm gonna trim off. Uh oh, where'd I put my scissors? There they are. I wanna make it fit. So we're gonna trim this L off. We're gonna trim that edge off. And what I wanna do this week is with all the craziness going on and the fear and the coronavirus and the worry, I wanna make a list this week of everything 
that I am grateful for. So that's going to be the primary focus of that side of the page. <coughs> Excuse me. So then I'm going to come over here and I'm going to bring in a couple more quotes. Hmm. What do we got? All right. So we're going to take this one. It says, do all the things. And we're going to put it right here on the bottom of the page. And I think that's where we're going to stop there for a minute. And then we're going to grab our washi box. And here's some bright green that I think will go really well. Grab my exacto knife. So, much as we do every other week. I want to take my washi and we're going to just highlight out the separation of the days. Oops, started going crooked there. And just bring a little more color to this side of the page. So, I'd love to hear in the comments below how coronavirus has affected your plans for this week. I know here in Illinois, we've got schools that are closed for two weeks. We've got limitations on gathering sizes. People recommended are working from home and not going into an office all right so we've got that down normally I would carry that over onto this page but I don't think I'm gonna do that this week so just kind of looking here. All right. So for a minute, I'm going to flip over to my productivity mini book. And let's see what we can find. So I need kind of a... There's today's goal, there's important. Okay, so we're gonna take one of these important stickers. We'll put it right here. And then underneath of that, I'm gonna put this little checklist. So this is going to be where I'm going to put my super important must get done this week checklist. And then let's see, what do we got going on here? I know on Monday I have a doctor's appointment. Oops, my washi's coming up. Let's see. I like the sticker that says, stay positive. And we're just gonna kinda put it here in the middle of the week. I covered up the 18 a little bit, but that's okay. And here's some black ones, so this one says, cross it off the list. Uh, 
Um, I know that Thursday I've got a couple projects due, so we're going to put getting so much done. I have a weekend project the next week. So I'm going to come over here in this space. And I'm going to use this weekend project sticker over here. Because I know this weekend we're going to start renovating my husband's home office. else do we have? Top three. Alright, so I think here on Tuesday and on Friday I'm going to put down a couple of these top three stickers. Let's just see. What else do we want to do? Make it happen. We're going to put... I know I've got a lot that I need to get done on Thursday, but I'm actually have a separate checklist for all those tasks. So I'm gonna put this big Make It Happen sticker there just to remind me. And that may be about it for that book. So I just wanna flip back over one more time to this book and see if we can fill in a little bit. Be so good, they can't ignore you. Let's see if that one will fit. I'm just really feeling a need for a lot of positive quotes and affirmations this week. And then, I think right down here, I like this. Yes, because it'll balance out the black a little bit. All right. So there we have it. That is going to be my spread for this week. So we'll get that popped back into my planner and ready to go. So if you like this video, hit the like button below. If you don't want to miss any of my future videos, hit that subscribe button. And happy planning, everyone.